This game used to be more fun. And <laughs> you used to be younger. And dumber. What matters is, you still just as fast. Because a slow pilgrim Yeah, is a, a dead, dead pilgrim. pilgrim. Yeah, I know, I know. Get up here. I want to show you something. Strong. Thanks. It's good to see you, Spike. I mean, how long has it been? Far too long. <laughs> but don't get all mushy on me now. Where are we going? You'll see. It's incredible. What's incredible? <laughs> Most pilgrims don't last two, three years on the road. While you've been kicking around for, what, four years now? <laughs> and you're still alive? So are you. I know, but I'm fucking awesome. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, right, right. Seriously, I wish I had as much energy as you. Got a new lead on Jane? Nah, trail went cold after New Paris. Which route did you take? Through Baines or Gary? Eh, Baines. What a shithole. Some five rickety huts left and a ramshackle fence. Look, Aiden. A beehive full of honey. Can't let an opportunity like this go to waste, can we? Uh, no way. Look around. If we're lucky, there's chamomile growing here, too. like right we've known each other for a long time but i'll still get pissed off if you don't hurry you remember that old herbalist we helped escort to her village oh yeah the one that had that saying um remember chamomile and honey are gifts that keep giving combine them and lucky you you might just go on living Come on, we're almost there.
Wow. <laughs> Somebody had a nice crib. Limit locked. I'll try to get through here. You check the other side. Take anything we could use. Yeah, sure. If those were the worst problems back in the day, I... someone, it means it's time to go. Party. Uh, but by then the GRE would have long since lost control of the virus. I wonder how the wine tasted back then. Nada. Zip. And that's what they called art? Uh, nothing here. Uh, 
Nothing in here. Empty. There's nothing like a party to celebrate the end of the world. They died on their own terms. Let's hope we get that lucky too. Hey, I'll see what's upstairs. You check out the garden, okay? Okay. She was classy. <laughs> Dearest Mary, I'm sorry I ran from you. They say that once the virus makes you turn, you're gone forever. That can't be true. I know you're still in there, underneath all that pain and disease. I'm coming to join you. No more running. God. Aiden, come here. Check this out. Sit down, buddy. For you. 
a gift from the heaven. Here. It's not. Who? True. Yeah. Seen this. Who? Just I track down that guy for you. Hey, what? And you're only telling me now? Huh. When I tossed you a beer, thought you guessed right away we were celebrating. The guy's in Villador. Supposedly, he knows something about walls. Villador. I saw him that close, huh? Hey, I, I got a favor to ask you. You deliver this to Gary? It's on your way. Uh, people don't like pilgrims there, but, but they pay well. <laughs> and where do people like pilgrims? Well, they're afraid of us. Everyone does their best to survive. Maybe. Boom, something needs to be transported through the hordes of infected. And suddenly, they're knocking on our doors. All right. But you owe me one. Just one. So what about that guy? Well, I talked to him over the radio. He didn't tell me his name. Sounds like he's got something to hide. See that antenna on the hill? That'll help you contact the informant. He'll be listening for you at dawn on a frequency of 140.200 megahertz. Told him he'd hear from you soon. I'll just go straight to the city. It's not that simple. Villador was supposed to be one of the zones. Cities that were walled off to keep out the plague. The plan fucked up. But this city and its walls survived. But this guy knows a way in. Get in touch with him and he'll tell you everything. What does he want in return? Didn't say. But he didn't sound like the kind of guy who does things for free. I don't think that kind of guy exists. What? What about me? You're an old fart who likes racing me, and makes me ask around about his crazy girlfriend. Hey, hey, hey. She's not crazy. Jane's just maybe... Well, and she's always getting herself into trouble. But if you could get a load of her... <laughs> All right. Still too early in the evening for that sort of talk. Eyes. I was going to say eyes. Beautiful. Steely. Huge. Never heard anyone get so worked up about gray eyes. Because you don't know shit about the world, let alone women. Yeah, you probably... I'm telling you, I'll finally find Jane. We'll set up a house. We're going to live there. No one's going to drive us out. And I'll stop wondering like a moron. I'll drink to that. And that waltz. What's his deal? Is he family? No. Not at all. <laughs> then why are you looking for him? Will yeah. you tell me sometime? Yeah, one day. Well, So when my will I see you up. again, huh? In another two years? Maybe. Take care, man. I hope you find that waltz guy, or whoever you're looking for. And remember, 140.200 megahertz. At dawn, the guy's waiting for you. <laughs> 